Well, details have been emerging in the days and weeks since Alexei Navalny first fell ill on that flight from Tumsk to Moscow on August 20th. Now his team releasing this video. They say they took this video and they went straight back to the hotel room once they figured out that he was ill, the hotel room he was staying in on August 20th before leaving to that airport. They circle three red circles here. Three red circles appear in this video. You can see these are just two of them. I'm going to pause that and talk more about these water bottles because his team saying on an Instagram post that these water bottles they have contained, at least one of them, traces of Novichok nerve agent. The nerve agent that first the German independent lab uh, said was what poisoned Alexei Navalny. That has then been backed up by two independent laboratories, one in France and then another in Sweden. In that long Instagram post, his team also saying that once they heard that they were, he was ill, they went back, they contacted a local lawyer in Tumsk and then went to the hotel room. We have identified one figure from this video that was uploaded on Instagram as being a local lawyer from Tumsk. But let's just put this in a broader time scale to figure out what exactly happened the day that Alexei Navalny first fell ill. We know that he was in Tumsk uh, in Siberia. That was on August 19th. He first uploaded this particular uh, Instagram. And then we know that he was staying in the Xander Hotel. There's a number of reasons why. First of all, his team says that. And then the video that was uploaded on Instagram, we cross-referenced from images taken within, the, within that hotel to that video and we know that that was indeed the hotel. He then went to the airport in Tumsk. We know exactly where he was between 7 a.m. and 8 a.m. local time. That's because an Instagram was uploaded from somebody who spotted him at that hotel. He then went on to and boarded that flight. That flight is scheduled to take off 7.55 a.m. local time. It was supposed to take four hours from Tumsk to Moscow. It diverted around an hour in and then went to Umsk. That's where he fell ill. Now his team said, this is new, his team then said straight away they went to the hotel when they figured that out and we can figure out what exact time they were there at because we looked at that video uploaded onto Instagram and we spotted this, it's a clock in the hotel room and it says that they were there at around a quarter to 12 and that's quarter to noon and we know that because it was light outside, it was daytime outside. These are all emerging details. It's first important to note as well that we have contacted a department in the, in the German government to see if they have any statement to confirm what his team are saying that that at least one of these water bottles had traces of Novichok nerve agent. We're waiting to hear back. But this comes the week that we know that Alexei Navalny himself, his condition has been improving. He himself penning this Instagram post uh, just recently in here saying that he was able to breathe without a valve. This developing story details have been coming out in the days and weeks since. This, the latest in this long story, we've yet to hear back from the German government on that or any German department, but this at least according to his team.